Have you ever wondered how banks and lenders might be involved in a car finance scandal? The UK's Financial Conduct Authority, or FCA, is currently digging deep into such a scandal. The allegations revolve around discretionary commission arrangements, a somewhat murky practice that has raised more than a few eyebrows. This investigation, which kicked off in January, is facing its fair share of challenges, especially when it comes to data collection. The plot thickens with Barclay stepping into the ring, initiating a judicial review against a ruling by the Financial Ombudsman Service. The outcome of this review could significantly impact the FCA's approach to the issue. So what does this mean for the banks and lenders? The stakes are high, and the financial institutions are bracing themselves. As the Financial Conduct Authority, or FCA, scrutinizes the industry-wide car finance lending practices, banks and lenders are being urged to prepare for a surge in claims. The word on the street is, they need to set aside funds for potential payouts. Now you may be wondering just how big this could get. Well, estimates are suggesting that the industry could be facing costs of a whopping 16 billion pounds. That's an amount that could shake up the banking sector significantly. This could potentially result in a significant financial hit for the banks and lenders involved. But what are the wider implications of this scandal and what should banks and lenders do now? This car finance scandal could rattle the very foundations of consumer trust in banks and financial institutions. It could potentially trigger a shift in regulatory practices, leading to more stringent oversight of lending procedures. As for the advised course of action, banks and lenders should brace themselves for potential payouts. They are urged to review their current lending practices, ensuring they not only meet but exceed regulatory standards. These institutions should view this as an opportunity to demonstrate their commitment to ethical lending and to regain the trust of their customers. In conclusion, the car finance scandal serves as a reminder of the importance of ethical lending practices and regulatory compliance within the banking and finance industry.